Hey, welcome to the Climbing Daily Roundup show from Climbing at the Olympics 2024. Today, we had the women's bouldering semi-final round and the men's qualifying heat in the speed rounds. First up, the women's bouldering round. And Matt, we saw a much hard, much easier set than the men's set from bouldering yesterday, didn't we? Yeah, definitely. There was uh, a lot more tops uh, the female round compared to the male round that we had yesterday. Yanya Gambra did manage to top all four boulder problems. Uh, and she did struggle slightly with the final one, which made it really exciting. Absolutely. She ended up being the only person to top all the routes and she finished in first place. Orien Berton finished in second place with three tops and Brooke as well with three tops finished in third place. Uh, I think you were particularly impressed by Erin McNeese from Great Britain, weren't you? When yeah, you I found Erin's performance really impressive. Obviously, I'm a big fan of anyone from Britain, really. Uh, and I thought the way that she pulled it together in the Olympics was really, really impressive. Absolutely. She finished off in 10th place. Another big shout out should go to Oceana McKenzie in fourth place. She pulled out a, an exceptional performance, topping three out of the four boulders. Something that maybe a couple of people weren't expecting, but she has been performing pretty well of late on the IFSC. Okay, next up, we've got the men's speed. And it was fast because Incredible. we saw a world record. Yep. So uh, Sam Watson from America did manage to break the world record with a staggering time of five seconds. Four seconds, 75. Four seconds, 75. That yeah. is incredible. Had to look twice at that. Yeah, incredible. It broke 0 0.04 seconds of his current world record. A massive performance from Sam and really laying down a marker. Uh, you'll see the results here behind us. But basically, there was uh, a bit of a match, match off between Basim Awem and Yaroslav Chak in the final round. Uh, it was super tight. Uh, it was Basim Awem who took it by 0 0.01 of a second to make it through to the quarterfinals. An amazing result, amazing day of climbing. Really, really psyched for it. What was kind of like your standout moment, do you think? Oh, for me, the whole thing was just so exciting. I enjoyed the entire lot. Um, I do think Bassa's, uh, Bassamoa uh, really, really blew me away. I yeah. actually met uh, one of the brothers once and I thought they were really, really great people. Yeah. Um, and I was really pleased to see France get through to the uh, quarterfinal. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. No, we're hoping that more French climbers can get through from the women's side of things as well. Oriane Berton really up there at the top of the leaderboard. That's it for today. We had women's bouldering and men's speed today. Tomorrow, we've got men's lead and women's speed. And tomorrow, a women's speed climbing Olympic champion will be crowned. Join us tomorrow on Epic TV Climbing Daily for the live stream at 9.30. We'll be having loads of giveaways, deals, uh, guests. We're going to have lots of analysis. We're going to have me and Matt on the, on the live stream. We'll see you tomorrow. Take care. All the best.